What a silly dream. Mr. Krabs had to close the Krusty Krab. Like that it ever happened. I have the feeling today will be like no other day. <sighs> now I wonder where Gary is. I should probably walk him before I go to work. Good morning, Gary! Wait till I tell you about my crazy dream where the Krusty Krab was closed and... Meow! <gasps> oh, you don't say. You had a dream too? Meow! 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 That something really bad is gonna happen? Uh-huh. Meow! 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 Whoa, that really is bad. Well, I know just the thing to cheer you up. I'll go fetch your favorite fetching stick. Don't you think your little friend Gary would like to play some fetch? Very well. Then move next to his fetching stick and press the action button to pick it up. Then you can carry the stick to Gary and delight him. You didn't think I was gonna leave for work without a quick game of fetch, did you, Gary? Now come on, boy! Go long! Longer! Longer! What did you dig up outside, boy? Hmm, there's something written on it. I think it says, Damger, Donut Alpine, Orelsi. I wonder what that means. Well, maybe we should see what's inside. Oh, don't be such a soggy sport, Gary. What harm can there be in just a little peek? Just what I always wanted, a muddy little bottle. Just think of all the fun we can have cleaning it. Here we go. Arr, who summons me from my endless slumber? I'll have your eyes for appetizers and your insides for dessert, for I am the Flying Dutchman. I'm sorry about that. Just hop right back into your bottle and we'll bury you back out in the yard so you can... Silence! I'll not return to that prison ever again! And what's this? You've gotten into my treasure, have ya? Ooh, I hate it when someone messes with my doubloons. Now, what shall I do with ye lowly knaves who dared stir me up? Let me consult my rule book on ghostly doings. Hmm. In the case of accidental discovery and wanton disruption of my booty, the perpetrators must serve for an eternity on my bloody crew. Well, I ain't never been out to sea with a talking cheese block before, but rules is rules, so I gotta take you with me. Are you ready? Hold on there, Mr. Dutchman, sir. Uh, technically speaking, it was not me who found you. Uh, Gary's the one who dug you up. Ooh, that's a relief. This little varmint looks like he can do ten times the work. If he can survive my hypnotic spell. <laughs> oh, no, not Gary. That's not what I meant. Take me, 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 not him, him, him. Too late. My decision is made. Now I've got to check on the treasure stashed back on my ship to make sure no one's been spreading that around. But I'll return shortly to pick up my new crewmate. Say your farewells before I return. Don't worry, Gary. I'll think of something, and it'll be the type of something that will save you. You can bet on it. Oh. Thank you. 
okay, not okay. Something fell on my roof and now my TV doesn't work. I can't get up there to fix the thingy and I'm missing all my favorite shows. No. Oh. oh, that's too bad. I wish there was something I could do to help. Ah, but there is. You can get up there if you try. Hold the duck button, then press the jump button to reach high places. What are you waiting for, SpongeBob? I'm missing my shows. A real buddy would get up there and make my life complete again. All righty, looks like I found your problem. There's a big thingy on your thingy and it's all bent out of shape. But it looks too big for me to move. You don't need to move it when you can simply break it apart. Face the container and press the action button to karate chop it. Save your gratitude, my jolly pink friend. It's all in a day's work for a sponge such as I. But uh, maybe you can help me with a problem that I'm having. You see, it all started this morning when Gary and I were playing fetch. Oh, on second thought, who wants to stay at home and watch TV on a day like this? I'm going downtown to see the new construction site. Maybe you could meet me there and we'll play Mermaid Man and Vertical Boy. Last one, there's a nematode. Who would leave a letter tile sitting around like that? It's as if someone wanted me to find it. That is no ordinary letter tile. It is a clue. Gather all the letters that spell your name, and you will have enough clues to find a hidden treasure. reach that other ledge but I don't think I have it in me don't be discouraged you can do it press jump then you can glide a bit farther if you press jump again before you land <laughs> Not very scary. How does Squidward expect to protect his garden with that? True. It is not scary when it sits still, but it's really something when it moves. Do you see that little fan nearby? You can blow on the fan with your reef blower to activate the mechanism.
water sauce. Clams in the trash again. Looks like Mr. Krabs will have to call the exterminator. Clams are just a part of this cycle of life. When a clam shuts its mouth, you can jump onto it and launch very high. Sometimes, valuable things are hidden in high places. Mr. Krabs warned me about playing hooky, but they look so fun! Maybe just one quick ride while no one's looking. Ah, you little troublemaker. Those hooks can be very dangerous, but I promise not to tell if you use your fishing net to hang from them. That's the only safe way to do it. Yeah. <laughs> 
Thank <laughs> you.